Well, that time is finally upon us. Valve have released the summer 2024 update. And you know what? It's not a bad looking update to be honest. We've got 10 new community maps, Embargo, Odyssey, Megaton, Catcher Area, can't spell it, Overgrown, Hadal, Applejack, Atom Smash, Canaveral, and Berghausen. Nice. And then we've got this summer 2024 cosmetic case with 23 new community contributed items that I and many others will not be purchasing, but we'll see how good the items look anyway. Four new community contributed taunts. We've got Can It, Cremator's Condolences, Straight Shooter Tutor, and Unleashed Rage, and then 38 community created effects, 18 for hats, and 20 for taunts. And then there's a whole load of bug fixes and changes, and oh my god, Valve are actually cooking. Probably my favourite update. Moved 2 Foot Invasion out of Misk into CTF. Let's fucking go. 2 Foot Invasion, when it's not infested by bots, is my favourite map in the game. I love it. Anyway, let's just jump into the game and have a look at those cosmetics that I will not be buying. It's it's perfectly themed. We got to barbecue render back, boys. What a time to be alive. So this is the Summit 2024 cosmetic case. It's got a very nice blue for the case. I do like that, but I will not be unboxing it because of how Valve have treated Team Fortress 2. I know people will unbox it, and that's their prerogative, but myself personally, I won't be, and there are other people out there who won't be as well. Let's see how good the cosmetics I could have received are though. So we're going to start off with the Invisible Flame. Looks nice. Vaudeville Visor. Looks pretty good. Commonwealth Commando. Meh. Not for me. Aim Frame is very cool though. I like that. Watchman's Wetsuit. Okay, more buff medic cosmetics. Okay. <laughs> okay. Brute's Bracers. That's pretty nice. I like that. Pathfinder. Again, the Daring Dell. I do I do quite like that. The Desk Engineer, a lovely cosmetic. I reviewed it in one of my videos a while back. I like it. The Brand Loyalist. Okay. Similar to the Ties. I'm not sure. Uh, Scorched Earth Stompers. Okay. Quite nice. Tanker's Top. Not really for me. Doesn't really do it, that one. The Tropical Brim. Very nice. Crook's Cap. Yeah, it's just a simple hat, but it works. The Justice Johns. Okay, um interesting build the sneaky blinder gonna guess that's for the spy could look pretty good the big star i like that control patrol very nice hat the tuxedo royale is very very nice just another brilliant spy coat he has too many good coats to choose from it's honestly a ball ache the fire marshal not sure why that's a pink but okay the freeman's fashion though very cool very very cool hazardous environment vest gonna go kind of hard i must say and then the bottler 2000 nice no complaints from me very solid set of cosmetics some bit air but most of them are very cool and then obviously all of these unusual effects as well nice all right we're going to take a look at the taunts now so we're going to start off with the can it taunt for the soldier all right pretty good all right and we've got the cremator's condolences this could be a pretty toxic taunt i'm not gonna lie we know people like to moan about pyro this might be taking it too far, guys. We've got the straight shooter tutor. Okay, that's pretty good. <laughs> yeah, very solid. Unleashed rage, which is all class. Okay. Right. <laughs> that's good from the sniper. Just one shout. Maggots. Lovely. Okay, nice. Alright. This looks very uncanny with no mouth animations, I must say. Yeah, I like that. These are all very good and in theme with the characters. They've done a good job here. Yeah, very cool. Yeah, you know what? Decent cosmetics from this um, update. Just look at all the people playing TF2, man. That's what you like to see. That's what we like to see. <laughs> but yeah, let's jump into the maps now and uh, see what they've got to offer. All right. 
my first map of summer 2024 is Applejack. And you know what? I'm liking what I'm seeing already. I don't think I've actually played this map though, so this should be a fun experience. It's Capture the Flag, which I, I love. Capture the Flag is probably my favourite game mode, if I'm, if I'm being honest. And I'm looking forward to getting stuck in on a new Team Fortress 2 experience. I think it's going to be a good summer for TF2. I'll just say that. Let's rock and roll. It does look beautiful though. It's a chicken. TF2 chicken. Oh, this is the intel room. Okay. Nice. Oh, fuck. I tried to save the engineer. Not my finest move. That's... Yeah. <laughs> yep, that's a spy. Oh my god, is that spiky Mikey? I want to explore more of the map, but I, c I really can't. I'm protecting the intel like a good little boy. But I mean, the bit I am protecting is quite nice. Oh, there's a little apple pie as well. That's, that's corporate property though. So I can't indulge. Chicken coop, chicken coop. We got chickens in TF2, boys. Chickens in TF2. What a time to be alive. I'm a war photographer. I need access. I want to look at things without getting shot, is what I'm trying to say. Because look, we got TF2 chickens. They're animated. Oh my god. They're unkillable, as they should be. What a time to be alive. Don't worry, boys. I fight only the hardest battles, so you don't have to. Don't know why there's a lone light shining on there. How did you miss? I, I was standing. I was standing still, and you missed. That's impressive. That's genuinely impressive. Even I. I don't think I could fuck that up as spy, and I'm. I'm terrible at spy. That's a nice looking map, though. I really like it. I'm a big fan. Not been to this this part yet with the the, the mixer, but I'm sure it's nice. We got a gun above the door. Could be a fish. Would be better if it was a fish. Is there upstairs? No, we can't go upstairs. Okay. It's a nice house. It's a nice gaff. Like, look at look at this dining table. You got pizza. You got pie. What more do you need, man? The American. Oh, we do have a fish. Even better. I just want to see the mixer, boys. That's all I want to see. There's chicken. Don't. Oh God! I don't want the chickens to fall in the mixer. That'd be terrible. Spy. It's a spy bout. There he is. I knew it. I heard you. Don't worry, boys. We got this. Right, we're passing through no man's land. And we, we immediately get peppered. This is not great. This is not epic. It's not fun. <laughs> we're going to sneak about. I want to see what their side of the, the base is like, okay? If it takes me a long time to sneak over, it will take me a long time to sneak over. But we will sneak over. You know, it is just a nice looking map, to be fair. Oh my god. I'm going to go on a limb here and say it's just a blue version of what Red have. Let's be real here. It's a very delicate mission. But we're almost there. That's a nice looking house, you know, it's corrugated steel. Compared to our nice red wood, which um, L for blue team actually. That's me. <laughs> that was not a backstab in the slightest. I think red have got the better aesthetic on this one, to be honest. You know, that looks a lot nicer than that. I'll happily steal the kills, that's what I do. No, vulture. I feast on scraps. Shit. Sorry. Sorry, bro! Oh my fucking god. Christ almighty. Someone piss on me, please. Okay. Well. I survived the afterburn only to die a horrible death, so... Great news. The piss wouldn't have helped. It's the only issue with the uh, capture of the flag. You can really hit a stalemate quite quickly, and I believe that is what we've done. So, unfortunately, I'm not going to see Applejack through until the end. But in my 20 or so minutes of playing this, it's a very, very fun map, which looks very, very nice. We're going to stop this push first, though, of course. That's what we do.
Nice. My timer is done. Applejack, you're a solid map. I'm going to give you an A. Wonderful. On to the next one. Berghausen. And I like what I'm seeing. I'm a sucker for a medieval themed map, so... Your boy's looking f Oh! Oh my god. It's... It's me No, it's... It's a new medieval map. This... This is all I've ever wanted. Oh my god. Oh my god. A new medieval map. You're taking the piss. Oh my god. This is so much fun. This is so much fun. This is so epic. What the fuck? That's terrifying. Oh my god, I'm so happy. Oh my god. I'm actually over the moon. You have no idea how happy this makes me. Ubersaur is king. Even if there's no Uber in this game mode, Ubersaur is king. Okay, I'm dead. Right, maybe uh, maybe Medic wasn't the play. <laughs> um, Rocket with a Sniper, I guess. Only one of a few melee boys. Melee? I meant ranged. Oh, good god. Good god. That didn't go well. There's only one thing for it, lads. Sharpen Volcano Fragment is the way forward. Shit. Is the way forward. He must defend the point. Oh. Didn't really work. Nah, this map's fucking sick though. Look at it. This is beautiful. This is a... Th Oh my god, boys. Multiple stages? Multiple stages? In my TF2 Medieval map? In 2024? Multiple stages? Oh my god. I'm f I'm in fucking heaven right now. You can't beat the sharpened volcano fragment. It's made from a volcano. You can't beat that. I'm fucking involved. I'm fucking involved, lads! I did, did nothing. I did very little, in fact. You know what? I did what I need to do to get the boys back on the point and defend what sliver we have left. So, you know. What the heck, man? What the hell? Who said he could do that? I'm, I'm over the moon we've got a new medieval map. With the chat. With the just melee restrictions and, you know, bow and arrow and such. It's phenomenal. It's all I've it's all I've ever wanted, man. I made a video years ago just wishing for this very thing. Okay, well. You know, it ain't easy. <laughs> it ain't easy. Oh my god, more stages. More stages. Oh my god, what a video game. Oh my god. Can you even dead ringer in this game mode? Probably. Did they have watches back then? I don't know. I wouldn't have thought so. Brother, what keeps hitting me? I don't like it. No, this game mode is definitely weighted towards the demo night, but, you know, fair enough, really. I'm just trying to be edgy and play Pyro, realistically. Can we even go in here? Oh. Nice. Where's this take us? Oh. Oh. Nice. See some uh, previous points, I guess, or the next point. Nice. We did it, lads. We did it. Yes. Fuck it, have that. Let's go, lads. Attack! Attacketh! Okay, mate. Didn't have them back in the medieval times, did we? You fucking fraud. Ow. What the fuck? Just wanted to get rid of my domination, man. <laughs> when did we do that? Didn't have these in medieval times, did they? Fucking meow! You know what? Lovely map based in ye olde England. Not England. Ye olde Europe, should I say. Fucking hell. Oh my fucking god. 
My aim is despicable. I should have hit them a lot more than I did there. One way or another, I'm getting punched to death. I'm not really a fan of it, to be honest. I'm, I'm going to level with you. I don't like getting punched to death. It's one of my favourite things to do. I can't lie. Like, what? Why does this man always have crits? It's one of the greatest fighters the Seven Kingdoms has ever seen. I was about to say, it's the only way I've not been punched to death, but, of course, my nemesis kills me. Melee hit reg is crazy in this game, by the way. That's what I'm blaming it on. It's definitely melee hit reg. It's nothing else. Well, that was Berghausen. Very fun. Very cool. S tier. I love medieval mode. S tier. Overgrown. I've played this map a lot. I know. I know this map very well. Um, C tier. I'm going to play it, but C tier. It's not that I dislike the map, it's just I've played it so much I know what to expect sort of thing. I already know what this map's about, I've played it a lot, it doesn't enthrall me. It's a solid map in its own right, but, you know, I've played it a lot, so I will just be dancing. Okay, I somehow failed how to conga. There we go. I've got a conga bind anyway if, if all else fails. Why... Did you just try to kill me, spy? That's very uncool of you if you did. Oh no, it's a massacre. Oh no. Lol. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry if Overgrown is your favourite map, but I will not be playing it. On to the next one. Hopefully one I've not played. First impressions. This looks fucking phenomenal. Just look at that picture. It's beautiful. I, I love a Greek-themed map. You know, give me some Greek mythology any day. Boy, oh boy, this looks... Oh my god. Oh my god, this is a thing of beauty. Oh boy. Uh, I like what I'm seeing. Oh, this is a nice spawn room. I love the vibes. We're shooting a woman. He's humping a woman. Great news, lovely carpet. Zero days in an accident. Classic, classic. Got a fucking salesman outside. What's going on? Even in ancient Greece, we can't escape them. It's probably just emoting in front of the camera. <laughs> nice try. Might have overextended slightly. <laughs> Ouch. That hurt. I'm top scoring, boys. Let's go. Yeah, man. Just look at the scenery. It's fucking... It's beautiful, honestly. Look at that. My God. Wow. Big fan of the ancient Greek um, culture, archaeology, structures. It's very cool. J just look at that, man. That is beautiful. This is... Oh, my God. This is a beautiful game. Ay ay ay. People! Why are there people there? I didn't expect that. I'm in awe, man. I'm in awe. It's beautiful. Don't point that thing at me! Oh my god, bro. What? Little rat. He was acting like a little rat. Fair enough, man. I should have just whipped out the old the old Soviet scattergun, you know? One of these bad boys. Soviet scattergun. Let it be known. No! Fuck! Little rat man! I need taunted. Ah, he's stunted on me, to be fair. Noob destroyed. Okay. Okay. It's personal now. Now we're pushing well, you know. It's a beautiful map. The, the outside scenery ain't great. Not gonna lie, but it doesn't really need to be. It's, it's decent, you know. Water. <laughs> ah, oh my god, that's an, that an insane kill cam. Wow. This game's crazy, it's got everything, man. It's got fucking everything. That's a beautiful spawn room. Oh my god. I love that. Oh, we got a little little cave bit. Okay, okay, I like it, I like it. Got him. I got my own back. That's all I wanted. Not really sure about the giant 
spinning saw blade they've got going on, but I wonder if it actually kills you. I mean, it looks very immense. Oh shit, I need ammo. That's a... They forgot to tell me that one. Uh, yep, someone did get saw bladed, so that answers that question. My god, boys. What? Nah, you're taking the piss. We've got a cap of point now as well. Fucking hell. What a cool camera angle, though. You know what? Actually, quite a fun map. The switch up of it being a capture point at the end. Very cool, you know. Could have used some extra time for actually capping the final point, but you know, I can't really complain over what's been done. I'm going to give it an A. Very fun map. Looks absolutely beautiful as well. That's, the, that's going in A tier for me. Very, very nice. Embargo. Right. Embargo is a very, very cool map. I've played it before, so I know what to expect. Got some meat cooking. You know, it's nice. It's a really nice map. Looks lovely. The theme is brilliant. I think they did a brilliant job on this map, to be honest. You're like... Yeah, you're invading Rojo's Casino with a paint bomb. And it's a lovely map. One of my favourites, actually. This map is beautiful. The, the entire map is beautiful, even the earlier parts, which you're not continuing to see. A little hot tub and everything, man. It's, it's beautiful. That's the paint bomb right there. Very important. Honestly, I just really like it. Uh, I've played it before, so I, I already know what to expect, but it's a brilliant map. Did a great job on it. It's getting a high ranking. It might even rank higher than when I ranked it originally. I can't remember what rank I gave it, but I know it was high. It's just how a guy I am, you know. This map ticks all my boxes. Well, m most of my boxes, shall we say. Well, you got little robots in it that you can fucking murder if you so wanted. Chin a little hot tub with your boys. They all got out as I got in. Kind of embarrassing, but you know, it is what it is, unfortunately. The boys don't want to hang in the pit with me. Predicted. That's a prediction right there. Oh, shit, man. Oh, piss. Oh, God. I've been fucking pissed on. <laughs> fucking hell, the entirety of Red Team just decided to show up. What the hell? Where did they come from? Oh man. Oh man, we almost had him, man. Wallop. Paint. Everywhere. Nice. Yeah, that was Embargo. It's a very solid map. I'll give it an A. I love it. It looks beautiful. This could be huge. Honestly, I like what I'm seeing. I know it's a nuclear test, but I'm heavy Godzilla vibes because, well, <laughs> that was in Godzilla. See some battleships in the distance. That's pretty cool. Um, yeah, man. We better, we better cook. Lovely bikini atoll surrounded by battleships. We got a nuke. This is Oppenheimer, man. Yeah, this map is really cool though. It's nice and bright, nice and just open. Some little buildings you can go explore. It's cool. Lovely blue waters, man. Real summer vibes. This map's lovely. It looks beautiful. It's a nice hill. I'm gonna guess it's King of the Hill because there's a hill and we need to be king of it. Go on, swimming. I'm under the water. Oh my god, that person fucking exploded. Jesus Christ. Ow! Ooh. Medic, please. Medic. Oh. Medic. Way. Why? Oh, we gotta hold it for a minute. 30? You're taking the piss. Are they gonna drop the nuke? Oi, there it is, boys. And that's Megaton, you know? Short and sweet. Just what we like to see. It's got a nice theme, you know, based on Bikini Atoll. I like it. And I like that it gives me Godzilla vibes. Because he's sort of intertwined with the invention of the nuke, really. 
and I like Godzilla. Nice theming as well, like the battleship surrounding the um, island as well. It's cool. I'm going to give it an A tier, I think. I think it's a lovely map. has nice summery vibes as well, which is always a bonus in the summer update. Uh, yeah, man, I love it. I think... I think it's good. I think it's neat. I think it's epic. Right, yeah. <laughs> On to the next one. Uh, this is the map I don't know how to pronounce. Yeah, I played this map back in the Tropic Crisis update. Again, it's pretty decent. Wasn't the biggest fan, if I recall correctly. And it's also a map I've played in Seasonal Lander as well. So I have experience on this map. It's decent, you know. It ain't bad. It looks pretty decent as well. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> there's not really much to say. It's an alright map, really. I can't really comment on it, to be honest. It's decent, you know. I've, I've played it before. I've played it before. Rare Gaslierist Gibbous owner. Very interesting. This is a vintage TF2 gamer right there, man. Oh yeah, I forgot to see the enemy spawn from behind you. That was pretty cool. Nice feature. <laughs> Quite understated map. Got missiles in there, or totally not missiles, sorry. More totally not missiles. Oh god, they're attacking. Oh goody, good god. Good golly. Why are they doing that now? We were so close to being done. Why are they now mounting an offensive? I hate this. Nice. That's what we want to see. That's what we like to see. I think that's enough for me, to be honest. Cachoeira? I really don't know how to say that, but I'm going to give it a C tier. You know, it's alright. does what it needs to do, but nothing to really write home about, in my opinion. It's a decent map. Uh, gets the job done, really. That's all I can say. But you can see your opposition from the other side of spawn, which is pretty cool. Atom Smash. Another nuclear-themed map. And I'm all for it, because nuclear power is the way forward, boys. What the hell is going on here? What the freak? It's one of these... One of these suction maps, is it? What, she got player destruction or something? Whatever it is, it's pretty... pretty cool. Pretty cool vibe, you know, nuclear test... gaff. With a little... little nuclear doodad in there. I'm fucking dead, like! Ooh, that is a very cool-looking symbol, though. Man and kangaroo, this is some... Australian nuclear tests? Australian... Australian Australian tests, perhaps? Oh man, look at that little kitty cat. May have been found. Schrodinger. Potentially missing cat. Funny. Whatever's in there, it's definitely radioactive, I could say that much. I do love the... Th I love the theming of this map, it is very nice. Not sh really sure how I died there, but, you know, we move. Oh. Just, just dinged like a microwave, I guess. I mean, it's a very cool map, don't get me wrong. I love the theming around it, but I'm just not really a fan of player destruction, to be honest. It looks cool, though. I give it a B. Didn't get experience much of it, but most player destruction maps are quite symmetrical, so... You know, it gets a B from me. Alright, we're off to Canaveral. Canaveral. Some sort of launch site, perhaps, of some sort of rocket shaped device could be a missile an icbm or just you know a little space lace what the fuck space exploration vessel to do bunch of gibberish two plus two equals seven we are sending our finest what is in here poopy joe taken too soon that right, ain't that the, ain't that the truth right this is the jimmy jam aeronautics division what's the plan acquire launch Clearance, establish radar comms, secure launch perimeter, and something else. Rest in peace, Poopy Joe. Taken too soon, for real. We'll finally find what the final part of the plan was. Prep dual stage ignition. Okay, kind of, kind of boring. Could have just left. Guess bro's enjoying the water. This is like a very nice looking map, though. I like what I'm seeing so far. Little space vibe, I guess. What the fuck? Oh, well, sentry gun's taken care of, boys. Fucking hell, I got ping-ponged around there, man. That was not fun at all. Another Hailzone weapon user? I can't even be on my team. <laughs> the engineer has moved slightly. We are making progress with him. He's getting there. It doesn't look like blue team are having too good of a time. I'm not going to lie. I don't think I'll be able to change that. I'm not exactly a gamer. This guy's got a Hailzone 
nut flamethrower. That's crazy. <laughs> that. <laughs> that was unfair. Quite frankly. Oh. Rest in peace. How is this guy the only Donny just chilling? Kind of impressive, to be honest. Oh my god, we're outside! Oh my god, lads! Go, go, go! We made a push into the great outdoors! Oh my god! Keep going, lads! This is incredible scenes! Phenomenal. No drinking for you, Sonny. Not on company time! No! Don't let them do that! I actually fucked up if they do that. I... I doubt I could do anything as Sniper, but we're gonna vibe anyway. Thank you! That was a headshot. That was a headshot. That wasn't. There we go. Oh, boys! What a shot. What a shot indeed. My oh my. Hey man, I got, I got my revenge. That's all I wanted. I will take that dub. All in all though, map kind of, kind of an L, to be honest. Much like Powerhouse, um, stalemate central, from what I can see. Um... Did hit some six snipes though, so I'll take that. So you know what? We'll give it a C. It's a decent map, you know. Didn't really get to see much of it. I imagine it's just flipped. We'll never know, because um, that's what I'm doing. I'd want to see the rocket. There it is. That's cool. Okay, epic. Yeah, C tier map. On to the final map, I think. Hadal. I don't know what I'm looking at, to be honest. I've not seen this map before in my life. I'm seeing circles. I'm seeing multiple colours. I don't know what the fuck's going on. Right. Alright. So the the different sectors, but different sectors are different colours, alright? We're on sector A. And we need to go to the other sectors. Just read them, bro. Oh, bloody hell. Bloody hell. Did we arrive in a submersible? I guess so. I believe we're underwater. Yeah, it's pretty underwater, is that? There's a shipwreck. That's pretty cool. I will admit, pretty cool shipwreck. Very epic. Why are you shooting me? I'm just trying to vibe. I'm trying to look into the open ocean, man. I love the little effect it makes on the ground. That's a very nice touch. Don't like the creaking, though. Not, not so much a fan of the creaking. I won't lie. Ow. I think I air blasted too early. To be honest. Oh, another Hail Zone user that's fighting me. Is that the real hint shot? That's crazy. The real hint shot is in my game, guys. That's pretty epic. We did it, boys. We capped a point. Let's go. Sector B, boys. To Sector B. I like it. I like it. it's colour coded. I think it's a nice touch. Ay, ay, ay. Everyone, everyone's attacking me. Didn't sign up for that. That's quite menacing, actually. It's the real hint shot. He's literally right there in front of my eyes. Wow. Just a bunch of guys chilling out, really. Okay, you had to ruin it, didn't you? With your... Ooh, we're gonna hit a market garden. Piss off, mate. I was standing still. Get a life. Grow up. You've hurt my feelings. Oh, God. I exploded. That hurt. You know what? I'm glad I got to have a look at this map before they decided to defend the point, to be honest. Got to see the cool environment. It's nice. This is pretty cool. Not seen this part of the map before, but it looks pretty sick. Okay, man. Yeah, like, look at this map, man. It's, it's it looks nice. I like the vibe, you know. Under the sea, which which you complete your boys, just you know exploring, man. Just exploring. It's a nice concept, though, having the the three different points to cap. It's an interesting concept. The different sectiones. Good map concept. Love the design they've gone for. I think it's a really nice um, vibe. But um, yeah, maybe execution could have been a bit better. I don't know. It seems too easily defendable. 
really. That's all I can say on the matter. Seems too easy to defend. It's a cool map, don't get me wrong. But um, probably better if you're the red team than the blue team, to be honest. Ah, red team's got a pretty interesting laid out, laid out spawn as well, you know, getting you upstairs. Yeah, I've got things over here. You can look up into the ocean. This is the point I've not seen before, so this is new. Ah, B tier, I think. Like I said, nice looking map. I think being underwater is a very cool vibe. I like the idea of an underwater base. I think it could have been executed a little bit better, maybe. I'm not sure. All in all, I've had a decent experience. I like this central point thing that you can cap at any time as well. I think that's very cool, but uh, yeah, this is Hadal. Don't know what that means. Don't know what it's a reference to, but it's a cool map. Yeah, man. Sick. I don't know. Can I get up there? I don't know. No. The answer's no. Yeah, decent map. B tier. Overall, it has been a very, very solid summer update. I'm a fan of the maps that have been added. And, I must admit, some of the cosmetics are very, very cool. It looks like Valve are continuing to push fixes after this update. I'm a big fan of the summer update. And if Valve keep doing what they've been doing, then the future might just be looking a little brighter for TF2. And I think that's a great thing. So yeah, hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, you know, like and subscribe if you want. It's not mandatory, but I think that'd be pretty nice. And I'll just see you guys in the next one. Peace. Hey, oh, uh, uh, I've been up for like two hours. Two hours. Yo, bitch can food took a few showers. Few showers. I don't buy my just money dance. Yeah. That wristwatch costs a hundred grand.